Today we're going to make a clay pendant and on that we're going to decorate it with symbols of something in your life. So the first thing to do, we're going to use some just pottery clay that's going to get fired and we'll decorate it afterwards. If you have something else like Play-Doh or some other kind of um, some other kind of clay, um, you can use that too. It just it'll just act differently when you decorate it. So if you have Play-Doh, you're going to use different colors. You can use different colors to create your different symbols if you'd like. So you're going to take a piece, and I'm just going to roll it in a ball and get a pretty good ball. Now, if I just want a round symbol, all I'm going to do is smash this in my hands. To get a decent looking shape this way your edges won't be if you try to smoosh it too much on the table your edges will get really thin but when you do it in your hands it ends up making a nice shape okay first thing I'm gonna do is I'm going to put the hole in for the pendant this way when it dries and I'm gonna make sure it goes on both sides and I'm going to smooth out anything. I don't want any rough edges. So every time I draw or do something to it, I'm going to make sure it's smoothed out. And I'm going to just wet my finger with a little water, and then I'll smooth it out. So I want a symbol, and a symbol is like a heart, is the symbol for love. You can do all kinds of symbols. Okay. So my symbol, I'm going to do a little house. And this is going to be a symbol for my home. When you draw into clay with the pencil a couple of things like when every once in a while you got to clean off the tip of your pencil because it's going to move clay around you also want to keep your pencil straight up and down because if you don't keep it straight up and down it's going to end up putting a big big gouge in it and you don't want that you want it nice thin lines and then i'm also using my fingers to clean up the lines so there's no clay sticking out and there, see these little pieces of clay? You want those off. You don't want those on your project. So you kind of pull those off as well. And then, so I'm doing a house. And this house is kind of a symbol for my home, my family. And that's what I think of. When I think of a house, that's what I think of. I think of my family. So that's why it's a symbol for that. Okay. So I'm going to put some details in this and keep drawing. Now, if I just leave this house here, see these little pieces of clay? I want all those off so it's nice and clean. And when we do the color part of this, you want those nice and clean. Okay, so there's my house. Now I want to do is I might put it somewhere. So I think I'm going to do a line to show the sky and the ground. Okay, I also want to do some kind of border and just a little pattern. So I think I'm just going to do dots around the border of my entire pendant. And if they're not perfectly around and even that's okay they're going to be pretty close okay and if i have any i think i need to make a little bigger i can make them a little bigger so there's my pendant 